everybody, this is Roxy, and I've got new decorative tape. It's not really washi tape, but it's similar to it from Dollar Tree that I thought I'd um, swatch out. I uh, there, There's only these two sets, but I have noticed this and this in magnets and notebooks and other little things, so... I'm hoping they're going to come out with real washi tape um, with those designs. Be nice. So I will find where I left off. See you. These are really pretty. And it's nice that they come in a little tape dispenser, too. So love is love. I'll do a longer piece. Hard to cut it. Doesn't cut it the best, but that's pretty. Yeah, it's kind of not the best little cutter thing. I think I'm gonna pull it off first. Oh, it's really not a good cutter. I just use scissors, which I'll cut these off. Okay, I'm doing this with my arm in between my tripod and not trying to try not to dump it over. One time when we moved into this house, <clears throat> we have like 20 foot ceilings in our living room, dining room area, and um, we could not afford, nor did we want to pay all the money that it takes to have somebody come and paint. And, you know, we both paint a lot, but why well, painted our houses? So my husband's up on a ladder trying to paint this one area where there's a, a stairwell, open stairwell, and then right like a little hall, and then that little hall, there's this area way up at the ceiling, about probably two and a half feet, kind of a faucet almost thing, or wall, that he had to paint. So I'm about having a heart attack because he had to put a board, two boards, over, over the banister top, which was, it's a wall with a wood piece on top, he had to set it on there, and then we, people would put up a ladder against the wall of the top of the, you know, like the stairs go down, and then there's a platform thingy, and then they go down again. So he put a ladder up over against that wall and put these boards in there, and I'm like, ugh. I said, I can't even watch, but of course I wouldn't leave. Anyway, so then he had this really long pole... And he taped, he duct taped a paintbrush to the end. And that's how he was painting way up. Because it's as, as, it was so high. But I, I'm like freaking out. And finally it's, he's like, he's got this paintbrush. You know, and he's like trying to reach and like dab in the paint on the wall. Because that's the best way you could do it unless putting up scaffolding. And I said, oh my God, it looks like you're painting with your foot. And he started laughing. I'm like, don't laugh, you know, because he kind of started laughing and the boards are wiggling. I'm just like, oh my God, stop. But it was the weirdest. I'm like, I don't know how they would have done it. There's no other way you could have think, could have thought to do it. But it, we're kind of like, oh, we're stuck with that color now because I'm never going to have him get up there again. Next time I would have somebody paint it. Just, you know, 
bite the bullet. Because I think all the um, bids we got were like, just to paint the living room and dining room was $2,000. And it's like, really? But I think it's because of the high ceilings and probably that section alone was 500 so anyways, um, here's these, now that I babbled. They're really pretty. I love, I really love this one. That's really pretty. Real pretty for fall or summer. That's cute. These, I think they have um, ring binders with that on it too. So that's the, um, when is it? July. They did, they do have new washi tape, but I'm not getting it. It's all um, smiley face emojis, and I'm just not into that. I think that's more for kids, but I did take a picture of it in my last haul. So, there we go. And thanks for watching. Bye.